Hi there, my name is Gray, and today's Form Labs tech tip is on what to do with your resin tank when you've got a new version of resin. Firstly, if you've been using a V3 of any of the standard resins, say black, white, clear, or gray, and you've just purchased a new V4 resin, you're probably wondering, do I need to buy a new resin tank? Or two, am I going to have to clean out my resin tank before I can start using the V4? The answer is no. Um, Standard resins V3 and V4 are compatible, so all you need to do is basically reprogram your resin tank, and today I'm going to show you how to do it. Okay, so firstly, what you need to do is slice up a part um, with the new resin version, so in this case V4, I'm doing it in white. So if you look at my screen, I can just show you that we've got a resin tank which is V3, and a cartridge that is V4. So once you've got your part and um, you've uploaded it to your printer, Find it. Okay, mine's conveniently called V4. Hit print. Go through the normal steps, check your cartridge plan, make sure there's nothing in the way of the build platform, and hit confirm. Now it's going to throw a warning at you, and this is where you get to change your resin tank. So just hit ignore, hit continue to print. And now your resin tank has been reprogrammed for the newer version. Now for the rest of the version changes, it's a good idea to either use a new tank or give your resin tank a clean, um, as you don't want to basically uh, contaminate between resins and not all resin updates are compatible. Um, there's a link in the description on resin compatibility and also on how to clean your resin tank. Thanks again for watching. Uh, my name's Gray. This has been another Form Labs tech tip uh, on behalf of Thing Lab. If you have any questions, feel free to email us or visit our website. Thanks again for watching.